Pablo and Daniel's family has been fishing for generations. But today, their traditional way of life is threatened by overfishing. So many small-scale fishers like them are diversifying their activities. Fishing tourism, where fishers take people out with them to show them what life at sea is really like, is an increasingly popular activity. It's called different things in different places, and it doesn't always have positive impacts on the environment. That's why WWF have published a set of sustainable fishing tourism principles. If it's done right, it can be a sustainable alternative activity that works for people and the marine environment alike. The most important point is that it directly reduces fishing effort. When fishers spend time with tourists on board, they spend less time catching fish. And when reduced fishing pressure is integrated into a well-planned overall fisheries management strategy, it can help stocks recover and fish numbers increase. This is an urgent priority for the environment and the whole industry, since almost 60% of fisheries worldwide are fished to their limit. Less fishing is the single most important principle. Secondly, there's no better way for tourists to learn about traditional heritage than by being a part of it. Out on the boat, they'll see firsthand how small-scale fishers support sustainability and will realize how important it is to protect <gasps> marine biodiversity. Personal contact with the fishers creates a new kind of connection, a meaningful one, giving tourists a unique insight into centuries of artisanal tradition. Having fishers and tourists sharing time together on board magnifies the social benefits this diversified form of fishing offers. The third principle is economic. As there should be more and more need for fisheries regulation, sustainable fishing tourism can help fishers diversify their revenues while protecting their local natural capital, if and only if the business model is strong enough. From home cooking to beachside bistros, keeping things local and sustainable means communities can benefit from their own resources and have all the more reason to look after them. Sustainable fishing tourism is one of the solutions that WWF is promoting to support small-scale fishers in today's overfished oceans. With the new model leaving more fish in the sea while raising more income from it, traditional communities benefit alongside the marine ecosystems that support them and a sustainable cycle develops 